a late night talk show host has mentioned Safe Moon. This is a very short video and it's just kind of slid on in there, but I thought it was pretty cool and I wanted to elaborate a little bit more on what my thoughts are on this. So let's go ahead and play the video clip for you guys first off. Could be the new Doge, man. We're gonna roll our own chain and mint that coin right out. Should we mint that coin? <laughs> oh, yeah. Big comms could be bigger than, you know, Path Fund, Safe Moon, the whole lot. Let's get to work, let's get to work. Should we get to work? Yeah. How Absolutely. do we get to work on that? So as you guys can see, he just briefly mentioned Safe Moon as a inclusion in this as they were talking about, I'm assuming they were talking about trying to make their own cryptocurrency or something. But with the recent drama that's taken place for Safe Moon, the fact that he mentioned it, I was thinking, oh God, is this going to have some sort of context talking about like a scam or a rug pull or a failure of the wallet launch or are they just going to automatically latch onto something negative because that's what like everybody else is wanting to do lately and oddly enough no he didn't say that he just kind of included it as one of these big things and so in James Corden's view and as far as his awareness goes a lot of people are paying attention to safe moon and he is also one of them so something I think that's really important to note with this is how big James Corden's audience is I understand it was very briefly put in there but you need to understand that when it comes to marketing it normally takes three to five business exposures before somebody does a follow-up or follow through with the next steps so if people are hearing you know safe moon boom and then some time goes by later safe moon and then you know another time safe moon eventually somebody goes what is safe moon and they go and do research and hopefully they come across some good positive uh, articles and videos and things so as you guys know, I'm a really big supporter of SafeMoon personally. And yeah, I was disappointed with how the SafeMoon wallet launch took place. And pretty much everyone was disappointed with that, right? But hey, that's in the past. We're here now. We look to the future. And it's still very bright. And there's a lot of cool things that are going to be coming up for the project. So I'm very excited for that. So take a look at James Corden's um, information here. This is an article that was posted back on June 9th of this year, 2021. And in this, it actually mentions right here. So when it comes to 1230 AM, the battle between Seth Meyers and James Corden is also interesting. Across total viewers using Live Plus 7, Myers Late Show averaged 1.01 million viewers over the season. And then here's where this is important. Corden's The Late Late Show averaging 971,000 viewers. So on the average, based on the metrics that this was calculated on before, we were looking at nearly 1 million people that were watching The Late Late Show that had heard the word Safe Moon. So again, it's very subtle. There wasn't a lot of detail included in it. But hey, when you factor in also that these segments get uploaded over to the YouTube side, now you've expanded even more so. So I think this is promising. You know, they say like uh, any news is good news, basically. Like, you know, <laughs> you got bad news, it's still good news. It's People are talking about it. It's still staying relevant, as you guys can see here. So when the wallet actually drops... I'm kind of curious if James Corden will make any future remarks in other segments later on. The odds of it are probably very slim. Um, but, you know, you never know. And we might see some of the talk shows mention more things about Safe Moon as it moves up. And it's just cool to see that it still has that appeal to it, even though we're going through these little hurdles right now. So, anyways, you guys let me know what you think about this in the comments down below. And I appreciate all of you guys and the support that you've been doing for this channel. And I, I'm, I'm very happy that we're on the road towards 10,000 subscribers. We're getting pretty close to that. I got referral links in the description if you want to get free cryptocurrency or free stocks. I also made a Roblox game that's kind of an introduction to the mechanics of how SafeMoon works. It's about compound interest and things. It's free to play. If you guys want to check that out, there's a link in the description below. Thank you guys so much. Don't forget to hit subscribe, hit the thumbs up like button. Feel free to share this video on social media if you think other people would find this to be interesting as well. And I will see you guys in the next episode.